uh, Palantir Technologies, Inc. Uh, Chief Executive Officer Alex Carb said new uh, AI developments at his company are so powerful that I'm not sure we should even sell this to some of our clients. At a Palantir customer conference on Thursday, uh, Carp told Bloomberg that he would provide Palantir AI products to the U.S. government and its allies uh, to help uh, further intelligence and the defense goals. Uh, but he said uh, he's wary about providing the tools uh, to local law enforcement agencies for purposes such as surveillance. I don't know what we should do in the this city. And, and Palantir stock has been on a run um, for weeks uh, after the company described demand for its artificial intelligence products uh, as unprecedented, uh, despite having no pricing strategy and offering a few specifics. And Palantir provided more details at its Palo Alto, California conference featuring customers that are using its technology along with its own executives during an interview with Bloomberg TV. Carter said the 19-year-old company still has not developed a pricing plan. I know we have the best product in the market, and I know customers will pay us fairly, the CEO said. So um, when it comes to AI tools, he said, um, this is an infinite market, uh, Palantir's artificial intelligence platform, which it calls AIP, is a new product but the company's software for aggregating and analyzing data has included aspects of AI for years. Commercial customers, including Airbus SE, use predictive analytics to anticipate urban maintenance problems, while the friends forces in the U.S. and Ukraine use Palantir's AI to interpret satellite images. In military contexts, AI could be useful for distinguishing images of, say, a hospital from a military compound. Information is fed into Palantir's larger software program, to provide situational awareness to military trainers, the same map for the citizens. Uh, yeah. uh, you know, some industry critics have voiced concern about the use of, uh, of AI in military context. Uh, CARP stressed that the U.S. should be the one to pioneer those systems uh, rather than uh, its, its global rivals. Are these things dangerous? Yes, he said. But either we will wield them or our adversaries will. Palantir has been providing its software to Ukraine, which is still locked in a war with Russia. Asked whether its AI systems work, CARP responded, ask the Russians. And then CARP didn't quantify the increase in demand, but said the company received as many inbound phone calls uh, in like a month that it typically gets in a year. Uh, some in tech have called for a slowdown of AI development while guardrails can be put in place uh, to ensure the technology is safe. Uh, CARP dismissed the idea of a pause. Uh, we have lots of people who don't want to roll this out because they have nothing to roll out. He said the company's all-day event held at Palantir's former California headquarters focused chiefly on the commercial uses of its AI tools. Its customers include Molson Coors Beverage Customs, Cardinal Health Ints, uh, and Lockheed Martin Corp., all of which are using some type of uh, Palantir AI-powered product.